This footage from Iran shows the often violent methods employed by hunters of migratory birds. It was filmed on the 24th of February in Iran's southwest Shedagan region. Poachers install nets by the side of lakes and use bait to lure the birds until they're trapped, a practice that's outlawed in the country. Iranian authorities have claimed that this footage was in fact shot in Iraq, but environmental activists say that simply isn't true. تابلوی منطقه حفاظت شده میشتاق را می توانید به وضوح ببینید و از آنجا تا آبگیر اون مدبس یعنی همان منطقه ای که 20 روز پیش پرندگان مهاجر قتل عام شدند با ما همراه باشید Many different species of migratory birds spend the winter in humid climates around the Persian Gulf. Every year thousands of them are hunted illegally and end up in markets as food. Our observer is an activist in the region. You won't hear his real voice or see his face to protect his identity. In recent weeks, a number of environmental activists have been arrested in Iran. This is our conversation with him, voiced by an actor. Here in Khuzestan, we're literally talking about poaching on an industrial scale. They even construct artificial lakes and swamps. They use this technique to target several species, pink flamingos, gray lag geese, ruddy shell ducks. Some of them are endangered species, like lesser white-fronted geese. Local environmental authorities have asked for local residents' support in the fight against the practice. But that's easier said than done. Poaching provides a lot of employment in the area. If the police take the poaching networks down, a lot of people will lose their income. They'll become even poorer in a region that's already hard to make a living in. In 2016, Iran tightened its poaching laws, with the crime now carrying a three-year prison sentence. But despite that, the poaching trade is booming. According to one study carried out by activists, between 1.2 and 2 million birds were sold in Iranian markets last year alone.